Bring your own device to Appalachian Wireless and get up to $300 in bill credits. If you're looking to switch to the Big Blue Appalachian Wireless Network, there's no better time than right now to bring in your device. Because we are you. We are Appalachian Wireless. On January 25th, Mountain Comprehensive Care Center will be at the Appalachian Wireless Arena to conduct the annual K-Count Survey for homeless individuals and families in the area. The purpose of the survey is to understand where the homeless are living and to help improve their living conditions. There will be a follow-up on the 26th at the Riverbank behind Paintsville City Hall to ensure everyone is accounted for. So on January 25th, we're asking people, where are you sleeping tonight? And on January 26th, it will be, where did you sleep last night? Um, we really like that change because that gives us flexibility to um, maybe get some people who didn't get counted the night before. And also um, it's harder to count at night in the uh, in Eastern Kentucky. We have topographic challenges and um, people are not in easily accessed places. While many are still struggling with homelessness following the 2022 floods, Mountain Comp is trying to provide help. It's important to count everyone going without proper living conditions. This count is, like I mentioned before, it's important to capture the accurate number of homeless that we have so that we can get more resources from Congress pointed towards this region. And then um, that way it will give us more housing resources. It's a direct correlation to um, rental assistance that is available for us. Anyone who, you know, once is homeless, needs resources, and wants to participate or wants to participate, um, they can call our housing office. That number is 606-788-9789. And a very nice lady named Mackenzie will answer the phone and she will dispatch someone who, one of our volunteers that is participating um, to get out there to take, give them the survey, bring a care package, whatever they need. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Nick Collum.